Hello and welcome to this pranayama meditation practice. I'm grateful to be guiding you and sending you love and blessings. Let's begin by getting comfortable in our meditation positions. Deeply relaxing our shoulders, your neck, face, jaw, your hands placed on your knees, face up, opening in all the love, opening in positivity. We will begin with how to practice Java Banda. Your tongue should be resting entirely on the palate, the middle of your tongue, your posterior and tip of the tongue, all resting on the roof of your mouth. This can feel quite strange if you've not done this before, but you can immediately sense the relief and just how healthy it feels to stretch your tongue this way. Remain here for a few minutes. You can take your gaze to the tip of your nose to help with focus and allow all the stress and tension to let go. Take in deep breaths in and out through the nose, breathing into the belly. On the inhale, your belly rises. On the exhale, your belly contracts. This helps broaden the upper palate. Java means soul and Banda means internal rock, which is used to help with the flow of the energy in your body, allowing it to flow with ease. It's also beneficial for people who have had extensive dental work, have tension and stress in the jaw, which can be led to grinding teeth, and also for people who have clicks and locks in the jaw from built up stress. It helps to also calm the nervous system and develop more inner awareness. Take a deep inhale into your belly, up to your lower ribs, and then to the top of chest, filling out the whole chest area, pushing the ribs out, feeling the expansion. Exhale from the top of the chest, lower ribs and belly. Let's do this a few times, preparing your body for focused breath work. While breathing in, the abdominal wall is allowed to come out freely. Placing your hands on your belly or on side ribs if this helps, just to feel the expansion and relaxation of the body. Getting to know your body, feeling the intuitive motion, your own body's intellect. And by tuning into our breath and body, we create space. This will help with the deeper practices of breath work and meditation. Take a moment to observe your body any pains, irritations, any emotions arising, and just let them be. If you feel you can't relax, then breathe into those areas of discomfort, those thoughts of worry. Use your breath to allow them to fade away by giving them a chance to be there and also to pass by. We want to allow our emotions to be heard. We don't want to push them away because the more we resist that emotion, the more it persists, the louder it gets. So if we can 
witness, observe our attention on those emotions and find a way to be at peace with how you feel with what's happening and show that emotion love and we can start to feel a deeper sense of ease continue belly lower ribs top of chest with a gentle smile allow yourself to relax deeper from here we will go deeper and fuller with the breath As you breathe in, take your hand up and stretch hands open. Stretch wide, opening your heart space. As you breathe out, gently bring it down, bring the hand down, bending the elbow in. Breathe in and open. Allow your ribcage to expand. Breathe out, squeeze your lungs. Finding our connection to the breath and movement. So breathing in, extend your arm. Breathing out, pull your arm in. So creating that flow. Coming at one with your breath and body. So on your own, let's do four on each side. This will open the middle section of your spine and diaphragm, promoting flow, ease and healing. First Pranayama, Ujjayi. Open up the palm of your hand and to bring our hand in front of you and we want to exhale onto the palm of the hand as if it as if you're fogging up a mirror. You can use the palm of your hands as a mirror for guidance or you can use your imagination. Or you could try it this way just as you would carefully whisper we create a sound in our throat and as you will notice this is the same sound when we find the sound we close the mouth slowly draw the air through the nostrils producing this sound in such a way that it touch is felt all the way from the throat to the chest clearing a pathway of stillness so as we inhale for four counts through both nostrils with that sound in our throat we can close the right nostril with our thumb and we can exhale for double Inhale through both nostrils for one, two, three, four. Close right with thumb. Exhale through left for double. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Keeping the sound in your throat as you exhale. So inhale normally through both for one, two, three, four. Close right nostril, exhale through left for double. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And making sure on the exhale 
you remain with that sound in your throat. So you're cleansing and you're clearing of any impurities, any toxins. Feeling the deep relaxation that this brings. So doing this a few times on your own. Taking a deep breath in and a long breath out. As we come into Sitali. So in Sitali we roll our tongue. Here we inhale through the rolled tongue and exhale through both nostrils. Pull breath, pull your breath from the base of the pelvic floor. Roll the tongue as you inhale for one, two, three, four. Drawing the breath in through the rolled tongue. Exhale as normal through nose for double. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. While adding extra focus on the rolled tongue. Inhale again through the rolled tongue for four. And exhale as normal for double. doing this a few more times. And now relax. Bring your breath back to normal. Relax your face, your jaw, your body, and feel the difference in your mind. Embrace the feeling of stillness. Allowing your mind and body to completely relax. Being present with your smile, your joy. Now let's keep our eyes closed and go into meditation. Bringing your attention to your body, to the crown of your head, to the back of your neck, to the lengthening of your spine. Breathing love into these areas and bringing your attention into your pubic bone around the sacral, breathe in to anything that arises with an intention of love. Moving your attention from here up to the front of your body, up to your navel, lower ribs, top of chest, Placing your attention on the loop of love we've created from the back of your body all the way round and up to the front of the body, feeling the peaceful breath from your chest to your throat to your jaw, back to your nose, to the crown of your head and out. Feeling the peaceful breath and noticing how in your presence all that no longer serves you fades away.
trust yourself. Let go into your posture and find the places where you may feel slight discomfort and just be aware of those places for a moment. Breathe into those spaces. Send them intentions of love and kindness in each area. It's okay to feel what it is you're feeling. Whatever it is you're experiencing, everything will pass. We want to feel our emotions and allow it to leave our body with ease. If we, we can have a tendency to not feel our emotions and feel our pain and by doing that we trap those emotions and store them in our body and until we do regular practices that's the way to release them, to let them go, to work through them and that's the reason why we can cry, why we can feel all sorts of heightened emotions during practice because all the stored emotions are being let go of. Coming back to the breath. If we find our minds to be overactive, to be thinking about the past or the future, feeling those worries, those anxieties, we always come back to the present moment, to now, and know that everything comes and everything goes. We don't need to attach ourselves to any type of fear. We have faith, we let go in love. We fall into the comfort of love. And we sit there, we smile, think of our favourite things, our favourite people, anything that brings us joy, happiness and peace, and we stay there, it could be a place, a place where you like to go and sit and just be not doing anything and just being away from the, the regular routine and the world around you. It's just you and nature. It's just you and that place. Rest in the joy in the abundance and allow yourself to bring that abundance to your everyday life knowing that you can carry these feelings of peace and joy into every moment of your life no matter what happens you always have that you will always have these moments. 
and that's how we can turn things around to love. We accept, we let go, we be kind to ourselves and that's what's important. It's okay to wander off in your mind. And it's okay to come back too. Stay here for a minute. Now stay here for a couple of minutes.
If you would like to join me to end this practice in an arm and three shanties, you can repeat after me. If you're feeling guided to extend this practice, you can lay down in Shavasana. So lay on your back, your legs open. As you open them, you can feel your hips relax more, your ankles faced inward, your toes pointing outward, your arms lay by your side with palms facing up. And you can stay there a while and relax deeply into the silence of your mind. Or if you would like to end this practice now, I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day, holding you in so much love. Thank you for being here. Namaste.